Hey everyone, I thought I'd come on and share my March favourites with you, as it is now April. So let's get into it. First of all, um, as you may know, if you've been following me on Instagram, I have been looking for products that will reduce the appearance of some nasty stretch marks that have suddenly appeared. I've never had stretch marks ever, but apparently at my age we've decided that with a combination of me walking in completely the wrong shoes and walking a lot, they've decided to pop up. It's my own fault. I know, I should get proper walking shoes, but I don't. I've been tottering around on heels, pretty much, wedges, you know, um, walking a hell of a lot, and I paid the price. So I'd be looking for things that would assist in reducing the appearance of stretch marks. And um, in my last favourites video, I featured the Vita Coco um, cold pressed coconut oil, which is phenomenal. The stuff smells amazing. But I've been using it for a while and it doesn't actually seem to be doing anything in regards to diminishing the appearance of stretch marks. So I thought I would seek out something specifically for stretch marks and combating them and reducing the appearance of them. And I came across this. This is the Palmer's Cocoa Butter with Vitamin E Massage Lotion for Stretch Marks. It's got Shea Butter, Argan Oil, Almond Oil and a Collagen and Elastane in it. Now that's very important because collagen, uh, collagen and Elastane will help to rebuild what the um, kind of stress of um, you know, over exercise or whatever has caused the stretch marks to break in the first place. So it does repair them with what they need, if you see what I mean. And I hadn't come across any other like moisturizers that had collagen and elastane in them. Now I've been using it for a while. I think it might be working. I'm very impatient with things like this. So I'm always kind of like, it's not working. And I've only used it a couple of times, but I have been using this for a while and I hope it's working. But, um, you know, if it doesn't, it's a fantastic body moisturizer. It smells lovely. Um, I mean, it doesn't smell like coconut, obviously, it smells like cocoa. But um, I really like it. I think it's very nice. It's perfect for use on your hands as well. If you want hands that look like, you know, you've had like a treatment on them, then use this. It's amazing. So hopefully it will work on my stretch marks, but I will report back. I'm going to do a whole video on stuff that I've got for my stretch marks to see if it works. So yes, the smell of this is divine. Keeping with the kind of body care theme, uh, this is new to me, so I can't really tell you how well it's working but it smells amazing and it's just oh my goodness this is the Nivea 4-in-1 firming body oil it firms skin in two weeks reduces the appearance of stretch marks even skin tone and nourishes um, intensely uh, and this has um, Q10 in it which is kind of why I picked it up because I know that their Q10 night cream is very very popular I know that people really like that it's got Q um, Q10 enzymes in it coenzymes with Q10 in it as well as avocado oil cottonseed oil and macadamia so I'm excited to kind of really really give this a go and trial it and see if it does reduce the appearance of said stretch marks i'm going to start naming them i think and giving them a name because i go on about them enough um and it looks like this as i said just got this but i wanted to feature it because it seems to be doing a lot of good it smells amazing you don't need too much at all in the slightest just a little drop will do um and it sinks right into the skin so if you're looking for just a normal body moisturizer that's got like added firming properties then the four in one firming body oil from nivea is amazing for that so i will see i will report back and tell you if it does actually work on stretch marks but just as a body oil it's amazing it's not oily that's what I love about it. It is not oily. It's not like it doesn't pick up lint or fur or whatever. If you've got animals, you just put it on and it just disappears. It's amazing. So yes, love that. This is also kind of to do with like my walking and stuff because recently, thankfully it's got a lot better and it, my legs don't hurt me anymore. But recently um, I had for like a month, absolute excruciating pain all up and down my um, lower legs absolutely excruciating um, and I should have gone to the doctor I suppose but I guess he just would have said well you know rest your legs which is not really possible for me to do because I like walk everywhere so um, I tried absolutely everything absolutely everything and this you know it wasn't like a pain relief but it definitely helped um, after I'd come in from walking this is the deep freeze pain relief cold spray it freezes pain instantly fast active relief for sprains strains and minor sports injuries and it's just a spray and if you know anything about deep heat, you'll know that um, this is the deep freeze version, but deep heat is the really, really hot stuff that just burns you wherever you put it on. That stuff is, that stuff is lethal. I mean, honestly, you kind of have to spray it outside if you want to use it. So I know that for sports injuries and stuff, you always use like cold or you use a mixture of hot and cold, but cold is a lot better for sports injuries and things like that. So I thought I'd try this. I picked it up and it's lovely. I mean, it's just like, it's just like a mint. What's it got in it? Let me see. 
Yeah, it's um, uh, denaturised ethanol and leather menthol. So it smells lovely, but it's really fast acting and it does work. I mean, it doesn't stop it, you know, uh, in the long run, but for immediate kind of relief from pain, it's really good. So odd product to have in my favourites, but deep freeze does work. It does work. It's very good. On to kind of teeth care and dental care. Um, I've been ever since Christmas, before Christmas, on a mission to find like really nice, um, wonderful, amazing teeth um, care products. And I, um, I will tell you, I picked this up. This is the Listerine Advanced White Multi Action Mouthwash in Clean Mint. And I will tell you that I did pick this up because it came with a free Maybelline lipstick. I know that's not why you're supposed to buy things, but it was really pretty. If you've seen it, it had like the little kiss marks all around the bottle. It was just on the cellophane. Um, and I sent away for that, so I'm waiting for that to turn up. But um, anyway, that's why I picked it up, and the fact that it was on offer, and the fact that, you know, it was really pretty. So anyway, whatever. But having said that, this is their new offering for their mouthwash range. It is really nice. It's lovely. Um, I was using the Beverly Hills formula, which was so disgusting, I just ended up chucking it down the the drain because it was just gross. It was so sweet. And before that I was using Corsodil and I've used before that. What was I using before that? I don't remember. Anyway, I know that before the other one I was using Corsodil, which is very nice as well. That's more like a professional one. But the Listerine Advance White is really nice. Very, very nice. So I would recommend that. Um, even if you don't get the fruit lipstick, it's really, really nice. Nice um, taste. It's not too. It's not sweet. It doesn't burn your mouth. It's really nice. So I like that. It's very nice. Good product. Onto a cleanser, which I got in the uh, Love Me Beauty box from last month, and I was really blown away. Not only because there were so many Rodeal products in it, but because of the size of this in particular. This is the Rodeal Stem Cell Superfood Cleanser. It's a two-in-one cleanser and mask for dehydrated skin with stem cells, rosehip, and vitamin E. And this, would you believe, is a sample size. This is 50 ml, and you can either use this as a cleanser, you know, to kind of get rid of your makeup, or after you take your makeup off to kind of really deeply cleanse, or you can use it as a mask. You just put it on, slap it on, leave it for like 15 minutes, and then wash it off. So I've been using this as a cleanser. The thing that absolutely astounds me about this product, I've been using this for a while, is that you do not need a lot. You need like, I use a little spatula to get mine out, and I've still, I've hardly taken a dent out of it. Um, you don't need a lot, you need a little pea-sized amount, rub it into your skin. It is like having a facial every night. This stuff is unbelievable. I would definitely consider buying this at full price, and I know Rodeal is not cheap by any manner of means, but this product is one of those products, just generally, that I think so many people would benefit from. It's amazing. Um, I know a lot of people go on about like stem cells stuff and whether that's true, whether it's correct or whether it's actually going to do anything for you. I don't know about that, but I like the rose hips, I love the vitamin E and it is like having a facial every night, so amazing product. I featured this recently in like my hair care stuff, my new hair care products that I bought and everything, but I thought I love it so much I'd feature it in my favourites as well. This is the Fat Hair Zero Calories Amplifying Hairspray. It volumizes, repairs, holds and, and has added shine. It looks like this. I got this in Superdrug. I got a couple of their other products as well. This stuff is amazing. I don't like hairspray. I've never liked hairspray, but since I got my hair cut and started, I really wanted something that would keep it from moving about when I'm out. And this stuff is phenomenal. The wonderful thing I love about the Fat Hair Amplifying Hairspray is that it doesn't um, clog up your hair and it actually brushes out immediately. So when you get in, you just put a brush through your hair and it's gone doesn't cling, doesn't show up, it doesn't look like you're wearing hairspray, it smells amazing, amazing hairspray. I will continue to buy this because it's that good. And my last thing, my last product, which is kind of, I haven't burnt it yet, but I love the smell of it. I can't bring myself to burn it. I just picked this up recently. It's the Yankee Candle in Moonlight. Um, and the reason I picked it up is because I went into a new candle store that they only sell Yankee candles um, that just opened in my city and I went in there and they were the, the sales assistants were so nice I wasn't actually intending on buying anything I just wanted to look around because they just opened like two days ago and they were so nice that I kind of felt like I had to buy something do you know what I mean like when you go in places and the, the it's, it's you're the only one there and you think well I can't just walk out I look like a right cheapskate so I my hand was forced really, I had to buy something, and this smell, it's a mixture of bergamot kind of pine and like really icy kind of features, if you will. It's amazing. I haven't burnt it yet though. I only got it a couple of days ago, but the smell, I keep lifting the lid and smelling it and it's just amazing. So if you have burnt this, let me know what it's like, because 
in the jar it smells phenomenal so that has to be a favorite because the scent of it is amazing and i'm sure when i burn it finally when i bring myself to burn it i'll be very pleased so <laughs> so those are my favorites for march i hope you enjoyed that guys i hope it was helpful if you've done a favorites video or a blog post or whatever leave me a link if you can down below in the comments because i'd love to check out what you guys have been loving this past month and yeah i'll leave a list of everything i mentioned down below in the description box as always so i hope you're having a wonderful day and i will see you all in my next video Bye, everyone.